My judging criteria, I mean, having been a trainer on a previous show, I know the work that they have to put in. I know what's a valid excuse, and I've got a fair good BS detector as well. I think it's just graft, just honest graft, but not just quantity, it's the quality of training as well. You need to teach the dog behaviours first, then reward. No luring, cut out the luring as soon as they possibly can. Having seen the list of celebrities who are uh, going to take part, my tip for the top, I think it's going to be Brian Blessed. I think he's going to have the character and determination. He climbs mountains. No tip bit. Well done. Over the A-frame, no tip bit. You cheated, Brian. I'm on right. <laughs> Okay, as an amateur, first time working with your dog, one thing that's essential is playing with your dog. Okay, then you can use that for the reward, you use that for the bond. You'll both enjoy it. It'll be a nice little stress relief if you get into difficulties. It's the most important thing for the dog. Play. It's all play as far as that. Top three doggy tips are uh, number one, eye contact. Don't do anything until you've got eye contact. Number two, get your behaviour, then the reward. Never the reward first. And number three, work on your bond. Play with your dog. It's all play as far as they're concerned. They're my top three. Best way to build up trust with you and your dog is just to be honest. Don't con them, you know. Play with them, become their mate, do what they like doing, use that as a reward. If you use what they like as a reward and not what you think should be a reward, they'll work for you. The toughest challenge I think the handlers are going to have to face is going to be the underdog kennel. It's the first exercise where they have to send the dog away from them to earn the reward. It's a tricky one. Everything else is emphasis on getting close to the human. This one's about going away. The celeb, I think, has had the biggest disadvantage at the beginning, I think, it's going to be Jason. He's never had a dog. I think he's got a bit of a phobia about dogs, so his learning curve has got to be extremely steep if he's going to do well in this competition. To meet the criteria of the courses and to do well, the celebs are really going to have to work hard. I know the dogs are going to be up for it. The celebs might have a bit of a rude awakening, though.